Robin Gansard is the president and CEO, the new president and CEO of the American Humane Association. So for those who don't know, and I know everybody does know, <laughs> tell us about the American Humane Association. Thank you, Steve, so much for having me here today. And I'm just delighted to be able to share with you a little bit about the American Humane Association. The American Humane Association is the nation's voice for the protection of children and animals. We've been on the historic forefront of every single major advancement in children's welfare issues and animal protection since 1877. For over 130 some years, we have been fighting that good fight to help build healthier and humane communities across this country. We share mainstream American values. We work hard on improving the lives of families and children and also improving the lives of animals. It's a powerful organization, and we're looking forward to sharing more with you today. It's all about community, isn't it? It is. It's all about building a healthy and humane community, giving the communities the tools they need, the resources they need to make sure that everyone has the opportunity to live the American dream. You think some of that has been lost in America a little bit? Oh. And, and that the goal, in some ways, is to bring us back to an America that was a kinder, gentler, more Mayberry America? Oh, I is love that. Possible? I love that. As you know, I live 30 minutes from the fictional Mayberry, which is May, uh, which is actually Mount Airy, Mount, Airy, Mount Pilot. Uh, I actually have a little view of Pilot Mountain from my home. So I, I'm a big, strong believer that American communities uh, are really hungry for an opportunity to have the resources to really make sure that they're able to meet the needs of each member of their community to provide the resources they need to, to grow in a, in a family that is not defined by the government, but a family that's defined by the family itself, protecting our animals. And we know that it's so important to be able to provide for that human-animal interaction and all the benefits that we receive from that wonderful relationship we have with man's best friend. No animals were harmed. If you've seen a movie lately or within the past how many decades you know what that phrase is all about tell us no animals were harmed in this film production it has been around for over 70 years the american humane association has been a partner with the entertainment industry to make sure that animals are protected in all sorts of film productions we are actually on the scene for over 1,000 productions across this country and across the globe, ensuring the protection for animals in all sorts of entertainment productions. What's powerful about this is we know that the entertainment industry has a great opportunity to portray animals in various ways. Our program ensures those animals aren't harmed, and it portrays a value that we want in our children's lives as well. We want that value to be passed on, and the entertainment industry with our program does an excellent job of delivering on that. Indeed, and uh, you have kids and, mm -hmm. and you have pets. Mm -hmm. Do you find in your own life your kids are more empathetic? I mean, studies show that having animals in the home Mm -hmm. actually not only increases responsibility potentially mm -hmm. for the kids, but mm -hmm. also their empathy as they grow into adults. Absolutely. It's just a, a natural. I have three children, two dogs, two cats, and three hermit crabs. So <laughs> we have a lot of empathy and a lot of chores in our household, and it all works extremely well. But it's about creating a lovely, loving community. And I think it's, uh, it's that human-animal interaction that's vital. If you can get a message across, one message... Mm -hmm. What would that be? And, and your goal, your platform as the president and CEO now of the American Humane Association. It's very important for Americans to understand that the American Humane Association represents mainstream American values. We do not represent the extremist discussions and beliefs, those polarizing groups that are out there working in this space. We represent what we believe are the fundamental values that made this country great. We believe in building strong and healthy families. We believe in building opportunities for that human-animal interaction, and we believe in the protection of animals. We also believe that Americans have the choice, Steve, in eating uh, protein and meat. And we want to ensure through our program, the nation's largest and fastest growing farm animal program in this country, that those animals are raised humanely. 
And if we can accomplish this, we have really ensured the safety of our food supply in years to come. A superstar in times to come. You are Robin oh. Ganzert, American Humane Association. You can learn more at AmericanHumane.org. I'm Steve Dale.